Hello, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Julia and in today's video I'm going to talk about one really really important sign that tells you that you're doing your manifestation techniques correctly and that your manifestation in fact is on its way. But before I jump into the video I want to introduce myself which I already did actually. So again my name is Julia, I'm a mindset coach and here in High Value I'm talking about all things consciousness, inner healing, self-love and manifestation. Now if you're looking for personalized one-on-one -on -one support on your healing journey or in your manifestation practice then make sure to check out the links in the box below. I offer self-study courses, I am also offering one-on-one -on -one support through email coaching and through one-on-one -on -one calls so you can check that all out down below. Now let's jump into today's topic. How can you understand whether you're doing your manifestation techniques correctly? We all want to know it, right? We're like practicing, affirming, meditating and then we're asking ourselves when is my manifestation going to come? Am I doing it correctly? And this is one really important sign I would say maybe it's even the most important sign that your manifestation is coming and that is that you are starting to feel different. Don't be disappointed, hear me out on this. When you're manifesting, you're not changing the external reality, you're changing yourself. And what happens when you change, your external reality has to change as well. And why is that? It's because your manifestation is not actually separate from you. Your manifestation is just a reflection of yourself. Your external reality is just a reflection of yourself. So instead of looking out into your 3D reality and wondering where your manifestation is, what you need to be doing is you need to start and put your attention onto yourself, which hopefully and probably you're already doing. So what happens then is as you're starting to shift and feel differently, that is going to be reflected to you in your external reality. So in fact, when you're asking, where is my manifestation? When is it going to come? When will I receive my desire? When will my desire be fulfilled? Finally, I'm practicing, I'm practicing and it's not coming. What you're actually saying is that your desire is not here, your wish is not fulfilled, what you want is not here. You're basically affirming that what you want is not here and therefore it's not here. What you need to be doing and maybe you already are, probably already are, I'm affirming that you already are doing this, is that you're not even bothered by when is my manifestation going to come because you understand that it's not separate from me, therefore it's already here, therefore I'm starting to align with it, therefore I'm becoming it, therefore it is being reflected back to me in my external reality. It's actually pretty straightforward, but I know, I know that it's sometimes difficult to really stay in this internal knowing that what you want is actually already present within you and you just need to align your internal state with that desire or with the fulfillment of your desire and persist in it until it hardens into fact. So the number one sign or one of the most important signs that your manifestation is on its way is that you are starting to feel changes within yourself, that you are starting to know that your manifestation is coming and you're starting to feel yourself as a different person and instead of being identified with the state of not having your desire you're starting to feel more identified with no no, no I do have my desire it's actually here I can actually feel it I can actually feel myself as this different person already I feel that my manifestation is here I feel the fulfillment of my desires and I'm not even waiting for anything anymore, I just feel so fulfilled and I feel like it's already here and I feel like I'm already the version of myself that has her or his desire or their desire. I don't need anything, nothing is missing, nothing is missing. I'm not separate from my wish, I'm not separate from my desire, I'm not separate from my manifestation and then in this going to be reflected in your external reality. But the thing here is you can't need your manifestation because you are the creator of your reality. If you think that you need it, you are affirming or believing that you don't already have it, which is separation, which is a separation that you're creating within yourself. And you need to become conscious of it and really always shift back into the inner experience of I'm creating my reality. I am deciding what I want to create and I persist in the knowing and in the feeling state of I already have it. 
I already have everything that I want within myself and I'm aligning my thoughts, I'm aligning my emotions, I'm aligning my entire being with the experience of me having what I want, me being the version of myself that already gets what he or she or they want. All right? Let me know if this makes sense in the comments below. This was a very short video, but I think it's very straightforward. So enjoy staying aligned with your end state, live in the end, stay there, persist until it hardens into fact, and your desire is going to be yours. Bye-bye.